Hi, I'm Patrick. We're making a little game out of our craft materials. First, our game will need some players. Mm. So we've got these plastic containers, but it needs a face. So I'll take these sticky circles, just peel one off like that, and pop the circle onto my plastic container. And press it on. Now I'll just get a pen, draw a little smiley face, two little eyes, and a nose. And that's my player's face. A little green face. It sure is. So, for a little green face, I think he'll need some green hair. So I'll just stuff this green wool into the top of the canister. Oh, there we go. How does that look? <laughs> Some green oh, hair cool. for my green player. Hmm. Well, my player's going to need a face too. So I'll give her a little yellow sticker. And I'll put that right there on the carton. Now I'll get the pen and I will draw a little smiley face. Two eyes and a nose as well. There. Now she's going to have some yellow hair. So I'll get the yellow wool out. Ooh, what long hair you have, Sally. <laughs> there. Ooh. Yellow hair. Her hair is longer, isn't it? It is. <laughs> Excellent. Well, my player is going to be on the green team. So I'll get these green stars out. Oh, all different coloured stars. But I'll take the green ones off and stick a few oh, on my that. green player. Thanks, Liam. Just those green, green stars. One. Thank you. One there. And one there. Cool. There we have it. A little green player. Well, my little player, Sally, she's got some yellow hair and a yellow face, so I think she might be on the yellow team. So I'll get some yellow stars. One there. Another one. Oh, a bit tricky to get off. Yeah, I'll give you one more. Here. Thanks, Pat. And no worries. One there. She's on the yellow team. Excellent. So we have our players, and now it's time to make the field. All right. All right. We'll get this out. Cool. Pop our players over there. Now we've got this big tray that we're going to use as our field, or if you can imagine a big stadium yes. around it, maybe. With all the screaming people, screaming fans, screaming yeah. fans, and um, this little plastic container here can be the goal. Oh, cool. I'll pop it at that end, and that is what our players have to aim for. Great, well, now all we need is a ball. So I thought maybe these pom-poms would be good. Good idea. The purple one looks like a ball. Excellent. And they're nice and light, so they can move around the field easily. Woo! <laughs> Excellent. Well, who is the first player to enter the stadium? Ooh, me, please. Oh, Go on, right. Sally and I'd like to play. OK, Sally, well, you're the first contender. Ooh. Let's see how many times it takes you to kick the ball into the goal. Okay. All right, are you ready? I'm ready. Let's go. All right. Oh, ah, oh, oh first I got it. time. <laughs> Claps for Sally. Congratulations. Round of applause. And the crowd's going Yay. wild. <laughs> All right, well, who's our next contender? That would be my little green man. What will I call him? How about Nathan? Nathan sounds good. Go, Nathan. Are you yeah. ready, Nathan? Ready? Okay, step into the arena. Okay, thank you, thank you. We'll need the ball. But first, Nathan wants to do a bit of a warm-up. Jumping up and down. Jump, jump, jump. Running around. Oh, some of his hair fell out. Oh, no. Pop that back in. There we go, and you go. Running around, running around, running around. Okay, you ready? All right, okay, here we go. Ready? Three, two, one. Kick the ball. Oh, he missed it. He missed it. Well, can, Sally, could you grab that ball for us? Thank there you, you thank you. All right, let's have another go. You ready? Uh, yay! yay! And he got, got it in. in. Great work. <laughs> Thanks. What a great game. It is, isn't it? We'll sing about kicking the ball. How about it? All right. This is the way we kick the ball. Kick the ball. 
kick the ball. This is the way we kick the ball. All the live long day. Kick, kick. Ah. How about jumping on the spot? Jumping. You ready? This is the way we jump on the spot. Yeah. Jump on the spot. Jump on the spot. This is the way we jump on the spot. All the live long day. Jump, jump. Running on the spot. Running on the spot. This is the way we run on the spot. Run on the spot. Run on the spot. This is the way we run on the spot. Oh, the live long day. Run, run, run. run. Yay! Yay. Hurrah. What a good game. It was a good game, wasn't it? Oh. Hello, Cassie. It's that time of the day. Time for us to puzzle play. Oh, great. Let's see today's puzzle. Okay. Under our puzzle is a picture to see. The four different shapes are a mystery. Guess the shapes to take the pieces away. This is how we puzzle play. Oh, wow. It looks like a great puzzle. Now, once we find all today's puzzle pieces, we can then work out what today's puzzle is. Hmm. Would you like to help? I think we're going to need your help. Lots of fun things to see and do. Here's a little clue for you. I didn't do I didn't think the ball. Just now, Do you like to play games with the ball? Maybe you can bounce a ball <laughs> or throw a ball and catch it. Maybe you can even kick a ball like our friend. Whoa. <laughs> there you go, Liam. Oh, a ball. Hmm. You know what? Maybe our ball can help us with today's puzzle. Cassie, can we have a look at the puzzle, please? That round shape there on our puzzle is a ball. A piece of our picture, it's time to show. That's one piece down and three to go. A soccer ball. Oh, and we've solved the first piece of our puzzle. Wow. Have you ever played soccer before? Or played a ball game? Or well, soccer, or football, is a game that's played all over the world. And our puzzle is a place where they play soccer or football. Hmm, I wonder what our puzzle is. Oh, sounds like someone else we know wants to help puzzle play. Hi, Penny. Oh, you can help. Thanks, Penny. Helping Zia make spaghetti. Zia is our auntie. Make the salad? Now we have to put in the salad, the salt. Daniel, is salad? Mark, is salad? Hey, look at that. Very good. Then get some water to boil. When the water boils, she puts the spaghetti into the water. Who loves coffee pasta? Who likes to taste the pasta 
cheese on top. Friends were helping out in the kitchen making some delicious looking spaghetti. And you know what? I think they may have just helped us solve the next piece of our puzzle. Cassie, can we have another look at the puzzle, please? There it is, that shape there. Well done, team. That's the puzzle piece, too. Here's another piece of the picture for you. Oh, look, it's spaghetti. Ooh, it's spaghetti in a bowl on a table. And that looks like an outdoor cafe. Where could this place be? Hmm. Do you like to eat spaghetti? What do you like to eat with it? Do you like tomatoes or eggplant or zucchini? I think I should make some pretend spaghetti now. It's fun to make pretend food. It's not to eat, of course. Well, I've got this wool here. And look at that. It looks just like spaghetti. It's the same colour and it can curl and twirl around just like real spaghetti. Excellent. Well, usually when you would have this spaghetti in your hands, you would have washed your hands, but because this is only pretend, I can play around with it right now. So we'll put the cooked spaghetti into the bowl, oh, plate, toss that round. Hmm, what should we put with it? These things here, they look like, oh, they could be olives or they could be little baby tomatoes. We'll toss them in. Toss, toss, toss. Oh, oh, olives escaping. Hmm, what else? Oh, I've got these little vegetable looking things here. That could be zucchini or anything. Pour that in. These look like some vegetable sticks. Sprinkle that over the top. And uh, what does this look like? That can be my cheese. I'll sprinkle that over the top. Spaghetti, spaghetti, it's the only one. It is my favorite. Yum, 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 yum. Spaghetti, spaghetti, it's the only one. Slippery spaghetti in my tum. La 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 Looks like my spaghetti's gone everywhere. It's okay, it's just pretend food, so we can have as much fun as we want tossing it all around. Did you want to sing the spaghetti song with me? I'll show you what to do. When I say spaghetti, you can sing with me and go like this. And when I say yum 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 in my tum, you can sing with me and do this. You ready? Spaghetti, spaghetti, it's the only one. Slippery spaghetti in my tum. Spaghetti, spaghetti, it's the only one. It is my favorite. Yum, 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 yum. La 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 that looks like some pretty good spaghetti, doesn't it? I went a bit <laughs> overboard on all the toppings, though. Hmm, now it's time for me to eat my spaghetti. Not really, though. Ah, oh. hmm.
spaghetti tastes very, very yummy, doesn't it? But do you know where spaghetti comes from? Oh, Penny's back. What a helpful puzzle bus she is. Hi, I'm Kel. My friends and I are helping with today's puzzle. That's how I eat my spaghetti. How do you eat your spaghetti? You just suck it. You suck it up, do you? Is that how you eat it? Do you use anything to get it out of the bowl? Chopsticks. Chopsticks. That's interesting. And how would you eat spaghetti? You're supposed to, when you, you get full and then you just keep getting. Your fork? Yeah. yeah. You wrap it around? Yeah. Yeah, can you show us how you use your fork to eat spaghetti? Mm. That's some great wrapping noodles around, isn't it? Mm. You put it straight into your mouth? Mm. Could you eat it any other way? Yeah, you just you just you just put a fork and then get a long noodle and then you and then see whether it comes together with it and then and then you eat it. Oh. So would you hold your fork up and try and get one noodle with it? Yeah. Oh, and could you maybe slurp some noodles up like that? Yeah, or like this. Oh, <laughs> like what? Can you show us that again? Slurping a noodle up really yeah. quickly. Yeah, or something. Yeah, you could, couldn't you? Mm. What are your favourite things that you like to have with spaghetti? Mm. Mushrooms. Chicken. And that's all. Mushroom and chicken, they're nice together, aren't they? What's your favourite sauce? Uh, sweet and sour. Sweet and sour? Oh, yummy. Because, because it, it's just that I don't really kind of eat sauces, so I just like sweet and sour sauces. Where do you think spaghetti comes from? Different country. Different countries? Yeah. Now, what's the country that they eat a lot of spaghetti in? In Italy or maybe France can. Yeah? Yeah. Definitely in Europe, I think they eat a lot of spaghetti. Yeah, because in Spain, they always like spaghetti and something. Kel and our friends were a lot of help, weren't they? Patrick told me that you've solved the second piece of the puzzle. Good work, it's spaghetti. Now, Real spaghetti is made of flour and water and egg, and it's all mixed together to make some dough. A bit like this coloured dough here. But of course, this is just pretend dough, so we can't eat this. Now, it would be put into a machine and then squeeze it into long strands of spaghetti. A bit like this. Now, if I push hard enough on the dough, it squeezes through the tiny little holes makes long strands that look like spaghetti. Now, of course, if this was real spaghetti, we'd cook it first, and then we'd eat it with tomatoes or vegetables, and even some cheese. It'd be very yummy. Now, spaghetti's a really good food to give you energy. Now, all living things need to eat food to keep them active and to help them grow. These wallabies like to eat fresh fruit and vegetables. Apples, oranges, celery, carrot, and sweet potato. They love to eat their fruit and veggies. This Scottish Highland calf likes her milk. Slurp, slurp. The kookaburra likes to eat meat. Lemurs like their bananas. With their teeth and claws, they can pull the fruit apart to eat it.
There's no banana left in that skin. Need to find another one, but not that one. There's one. These apes like bananas too. So do their babies. It gives them energy to swing and play. So, food gives us energy to exercise and do other things like, like cleaning up. <laughs> Looks like Patrick's forgotten to clean up the spaghetti he made earlier. I better do it for him. Now I'll just put all the little pom-poms away in this container. And I'll put the spaghetti away in this container here. There we go, we don't want to leave a big mess. And I'll put this coloured dough in this container. Well, we've got a lot of containers here, don't we? Hmm, maybe we could try and build something out of it. Would you like to build something as well? Come on, let's see what we can make. Have you got some containers? Oh. Build, 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 build it very high. Build, 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 build it to the sky. Build it here, build it there, build it everywhere. Build it in, build it out, build it all about. Build, 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 build it very high. Build, 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 build it to the sky. Hey, Liam. Hey, Patrick. Thanks for cleaning up my spaghetti. That's all right. I forgot about it. Nice tower. Thank you. Hey, why don't we build with our hands? OK. Build, 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 build it very high. Build, 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 build it to the sky. Build it here, build it there, build it everywhere. Build it in, build it out, build it all about. Build, 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 build it very high. Build, 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 build it to the sky. Whoa, Whoa. we're getting pretty high now. Yeah. <laughs> hey, Liam, I love your building here. Thank you. Um, but. It's looking a little bit wobbly. Wobbly? Yeah, um... What do you mean? Looks like it's about to fall over. Hmm, I think I see what you mean. It's leaning over to one side a lot, isn't it? Hmm, hey, you know what this leaning over shape reminds me of something. Can we have a look at the puzzle, please, Cassie? You're flying through now. What could it be? Let's see what's under puzzle piece three. Yes, that shape there, Cassie. That tall building that's leaning over to the side. It's a very famous tower in a city called Pisa. And the tower is called the Leaning Tower of Pisa. Mm -hmm. Wow. Have you ever seen the Leaning Tower of Pisa? It was built many, many years ago, and it was supposed to be a bell tower. But it was built on ground that was soft, and it wasn't very solid. So, it started to lean. Oh. But they fixed it. Oh. Thanks, Liam. No worries. But then it started to lean to the other side. Leaning, Ooh. leaning, leaning. Ah. And they fixed it again. Actually, it's still leaning today, but it hasn't fallen over. Well, that's a good thing. But we still haven't solved today's puzzle. You're right. There's still one more piece to go. Today's letter. Ah. A, B, C, D, E, F, G. I wonder what today's letter will be. The letter I. Ink, used for painting or writing. Igloo, a house made of ice. Iguana, a type of lizard. The letter I. And this is how you sign the letter I in sign language.
just like that. That's right. Interesting, Liam. Can you think of any words that begin with the letter I? Well, the letter I is our final piece of the puzzle. That's right. Why don't we take a look at what's underneath the letter I? The final piece for all to see. Can you guess what today's puzzle could be? Well, now we've got all the pieces of the puzzle and we can see the picture underneath. Now, we've got a bowl of spaghetti, a soccer ball, a leaning tower, that was the leaning tower of Pisa, and we've got the letter I. Yes, let's try and solve this. Okay. Today, we made a game that involved a ball and we also saw our friends kicking a ball outside. Yes, and we saw some real spaghetti being made and we made our own pretend spaghetti out of craft materials. That's right. And we also made a leaning tower and we learnt about the leaning tower of Pisa. Hmm. And today's letter is the letter I. Hmm. So it's got something to do with the letter I. Yes. I know. The leaning tower of Pisa is in a city called Pisa, which is in a country called Italy. Ah. And spaghetti is made in Italy. Italy is famous for its spaghetti and other pastas. That's right. And soccer is the most popular sport in Italy. Yes. And the word Italy starts with the letter I. So, today's puzzle is... I, I is, is for Italy. Italy. Congratulations to everyone. Today's puzzle was so much fun. Puzzle play. That was a great puzzle. Do you know any Italian words? In Italy, they speak a completely different language called Italian. Some of the words we use now are Italian, especially some of the words we use for food, like zucchini, or spaghetti and broccoli, or pizza and pasta. Our friends know some Italian words and songs. Do you know any of these? I can get to 10 in Italian. Uno, do, tre, quattro, cinque, sei, sette, Today's puzzle play was so much fun. I'm off to make another one. Thanks, Kathy. What a great puzzle it's been. It's time for us to go, but we'll see you on our next show. Thank you for coming. Thank you for being my friend. We've had a fun time, and we'll be back real soon. Thank you for showing us how to kick a ball. Yeah. Thank you for building with me. Thanks for showing us how to cook and eat spaghetti and broccoli. Thank you, Penny. Oh, thank you, Cassie, as well. Bye-bye. And most importantly, a big thank you to you for another great puzzle play. We solved the puzzle. Yay! Here we go. Let's dance. Clap your hands in the air. Now roll like a bear. Rawr. Jump all around. Set feet on the ground. Step, step. It's a cool way to dance every day. We, we all work together the puzzle play way. Keep yourself moving. Have a happy day. Thanks for helping us solve the puzzle. Helping us learn. And helping us play. Who solved the puzzle? You solved the puzzle. See you next time. See you later. Thank you. Bye. Bye.